defense today? Uh, I think that we made a lot of adjustments uh, during the course of the scrimmage. We came out, fired up, wanted to get after the offense. You know, it's a battle during camp. You don't want them to get one up on us. Uh, a lot of the young guys came in and stepped up. Some of the young guys got uh, rest with the ones, and they did uh, exceptionally well. Twos and threes, uh, we, we really felt like there's no letdown to, uh, to our defense. So when we sub guys in, is you know, just to keep the tempo going. And the offense tried to get the tempo up on us. But I think we responded well. We got some plays, which is going to happen. We got interceptions. We got some forced fumbles. So I think today was a, was a good day, but we always got to get better. A lot of eyes are on uh, Teron Williams to step up in line by 40. You know, him. Oh, definitely. Uh, Teron, uh, Teron is basically, we've been together since, you know, our freshman year. But uh, he's, he's doing a great job. He's one of the uh, other captains, and he's, he's doing a great job. We communicate. We call the left side the strong side. And uh, we, we, we consider that side locked down. And uh, right now, I feel like he's playing uh, above and beyond his potential. He's a, a smart player, and uh, he, we always talk and communicate and get the other guys on the other side to talk and communicate. And that's doing a, he's doing a great job coming up and filling holes and playing routes. And he got an interception yesterday, which was a great pick and big hit. So he's doing a great job. You mentioned a couple of those young guys that got some reps with the ones. Any of those in particular that stand out to you who could maybe make an immediate impact on Bowling Green? Oh, definitely. Uh, I feel like wonderful Terry and uh, – uh, DeAndre Simmons. <laughs> DeAndre Simmons, I feel like they're, they're doing a great job. Uh, uh, they're both, you know, small corners, but at the same time, they play big, and uh, they, they, they have great footwork and great technique, and they're just getting better. I mean, it, it, only time will tell, and I, I feel like they're just going to come in and make a major impact, you know, when we put them in different spots, and definitely get me rest when I need it in, in some of the other corners, and I just feel very confident about their uh, abilities. Talked about running a lot of no huddle today, too, in practice. How did you guys fair with that, preparing for Bowling Green, who does those sort of things? Oh, running no huddle was, was, I mean, we've been doing tempo since the spring. I mean, of course, it's a little hotter now. But uh, I feel like we're, we're adjusting to it very well. Uh, I feel like the guys are getting the checks and we're getting the calls in quicker. And uh, we, we, we're just moving around a lot faster because we know that Bowling Green, like you said, it runs up tempo offense. And, I mean, in, in some, but we, we ran against some uh, up tempo offenses. But now that we got the young guys, we got to get them acclimated into the, to the defense and the scheme. But I feel like they're taking on that, their roles very well and we're coming together as a defense. How are you lifting?